For the Rocha family, this has been their refuge during COVID-19. They say for them, it's all about love of family. This is kind of the overall layout. Isabel Velez gives us a tour of the place she will call home for the next 14 days. A small but well-equipped cabana at the home of her aunt. Isabel just returned home from college in Portland. I actually drove back here. 10 hours just because I didn't want to get on, on an airplane and, and just being in close proximity with somebody else that I didn't know where they were at. Isabel says during her two-week pre-holiday quarantine, she'll stand on the cabana doorstep to get fresh air, always wearing a mask. Because sometimes I just need to talk to somebody. So Thanksgiving was just really different. You know? Andres Rocha returned home from Fordham University before Thanksgiving, and to make sure he didn't bring the virus home, he spent the holiday in the cabana. I came and I quarantined for exactly two weeks, lived in there, probably just hung out, you know, did my homework, watched TV, and just spent time in there by myself. All to protect the family they want so desperately to see this holiday like their elderly grandmother. So I kind of have a lot of talking to myself and uh, took up crocheting. For Marisa Garcia, two weeks in the quarantine cabana was about getting to see her dad, who is still recovering from a heart transplant and doesn't have the strongest immune system. She flew in from New York. I don't want to be the reason that one of my loved ones ends up in the hospital or dies. So it was an easy decision. It wasn't a hard choice to make. Oh, no, I am not taking any chances. Kim Rocha thoroughly cleans the cabana after each family member quarantines inside. If we think about it in a way where um, if I could give my family a gift of having more Christmases from this point forward together, then I'll do it. I'll do what it takes. For Isabel, that means one more week before she's finally able to hug mom and dad again. Yes, I can't wait to get home. <laughs> this is real and we need to protect the people that we love. It's it's no joke. All the amenities you need. Damien Trujillo, NBC Bay Area News.